the Knife. My name is Tanya Gosen. I'll be hosting this episode. I have in the studio with me tonight uh, Frank Carroll from the Frank Carroll Band. How are you? Good, Good to have you here. So when did you start playing? Um, I started uh, playing when I was about 12 years old. Has music always been a passion of yours? Yes, um, from day one, yes. So. Did you inherit it from your parents or is it something... <laughs> I don't think music is, uh, is a thing that you could inherit from your parents. I think that, uh, you know, you have to... I'm not trained, so I think, you know, for, in my case, I think it was I was just born to play music. So would you say that uh, this is the career that you always longed for? Yes. From, young, from a young age? Well, I think in the beginning I used to be a policeman when I was really young, and um, actually I later did that for a while. Oh, really? Bef yeah. Before going on. Yeah. You sing, and what other instruments do you play? I play guitar. You play guitar? Mm -hmm. Great. Um, what, did, what prompted you to start your own band? Well, actually, I came to Canada. I met... Um, I did studio work in the Bahamas. I worked for, for you know, several different studios and, and wrote diff um, songs for different artists in okay. the Bahamas. And I met a Canadian girl that had a baby for me in 1979, and that's what made me come to Canada. And go solo. And go solo. Yeah. So, how long has the Frank Carroll band been together? Um, well, this particular band maybe for about a year. So, so it's all, musicians always, you know, they're are always, always changing. changing. You know. Right, I understand. So, where would you guys say that you first got your, well, not necessarily your big break, but where did you guys start performing? Was it in nightclubs or high schools? Like, did you just start off in well, somebody's backyard in a band? Me, you, you, you're talking about me. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, actually, about three years after I started to play, I played with a band called the Nassau Winds out of Nassau, Bahamas. I'm from the Bahamas originally. Right. And we played, we started playing in a club called, called Saddler's Pub. Sort of like a famous club in uh, the Bahamas at the time. How are, how are things um, compared t uh, from the Bahamas to Canada, musical-wise? Is, well, it, is it pretty competitive? Like in Canada compared to the Bahamas, or is it pretty laid back? Well, for me, for doing what I do, like, I, I'm into sort of like island music mix, mixed with, uh, with rock, so it's called, well, I call it rock reggae, so I think it's less competition up here for that, but that's not the whole purpose behind what I'm doing musically. Right. What other artist music do you play besides, um, you were mentioning to me earlier, you play Carly Simon, yeah. uh, James Taylor. Oh yes, but this thing I'm doing here, I'm, you know, I also do like an acoustic thing. I've got a six-piece band, and that's uh, primarily reggae and a little bit of rock and so like other stuff mixed up. But what I'm doing here is all like an unplug thing, and I've just got my bass player with me, and we do some classic rock and we do some original stuff and some Bob Marley and. So unplugged is a new um, terminology for just acoustics. I take yes. it then. Yeah. Great. Um, where is the band originally from? So where are you guys based right now? We're based out of Edmonton right now. 